Now, Halloween may be a little less sweet this year. Soaring cocoa prices may cause many families to rethink their candy choices. Julie Sharp joins us now live with more details. Julie. That's right, Adam. I spoke with an expert today who says cocoa prices have gone up 190% compared to last year. Trick or treaters may notice a change in their candy bags this year with less chocolate and possibly more chips. I feel like I'm getting like a lot of like cheap stuff, like like chips, all that. Not as much chocolate or like stuff like M&Ms. I'm not getting much M&Ms anymore, like Reese's, any of that. I like going trick or treating. Callan George is dressing up as a glow-in-the-dark skeleton. He says his favorite candy is... Kit Kats and, like, Starburst and all those candies. His father, Adam George, says, like usual, he'll be handing out candy this year. Uh, typically just, like, sour candies, uh, you know, sweets, maybe a chocolate. Have you noticed an increase in the chocolate prices? Um, a little bit. But he says that's not stopping him from buying them. Actually not, no. Uh, recently I've been trying to mix with maybe chips, uh, some other candy, mm, kind of like nerds and stuff. Chocolate's more expensive and I don't know, kids like uh, have to have a choice, I guess. Director of Dalhousie University's Agri-Foods Lab, Sylvain Charlebois, says chocolate prices have more than doubled this year. Cocoa prices have actually gone up 119% since last year. I don't think trick-or-treaters will want to hear this, but uh, our guess is that uh, we're likely going to see fewer households giving out chocolate this year just because of, of prices, right? A local chocolate shop owner tells me she has seen an increase in chocolate ingredients. Calibau chocolate from Belgium, they increase the price. Right now, the white chocolate and vegan chocolate, they increase 25%, and milk chocolate, they increase 20%. Uh, those are our raw chocolate material. She says despite the increase in cocoa prices, she's still keeping the prices the same for her customers. Charla Bois says another issue trick-or-treaters and shoppers may run into this year is smaller chocolate bars and lesser amounts in the package, not only because of the spike in cocoa prices, but also the increase in the price of sugar. At last year, we did see uh, smaller bars. They're even smaller this year, and you have fewer per box as well, or per bag. But Charla Bois says there is some light at the end of the tunnel. We've been looking at uh, deals this week across the country. So uh, if you're out there and you really want to treat trick-or-treaters, you can still buy chocolate, uh, chocolate at a decent price. Charla Boss says if you want to take advantage of the current deals, it's best to shop around. He says pharmacies tend to be more expensive. 